Scots caught up in the Nepal earthquake aftermath The number of Scots are known to have been caught up in the Nepal earthquake and subsequent avalanches which hit the Everest region. James Grief, 52, from Kinross became trapped on Mount Everest along with four others from the UK. Another two men, Joseph Feeney and Callum Henderson, on a trekking trip to Nepal were safe but stranded. A woman from Glasgow, initially reported missing, has been located and has been in contact with her family. Nearly 2,000 people have been killed in the earthquake and avalanches, which have been described as the worst to hit Nepal in more than 80 years. Five junior Scottish fire and rescue service officers from Aberdeen are to be deployed to Nepal to help with the recovery operation as part of the International Search and Rescue Service. Very worried Jacqueline told, aged 34, from Glasgow, was traveling in Nepal and was listed as missing on a Red Cross database set up in the aftermath of the disaster. Her father, Philip told, said the family were very worried, as they hadn't been in contact with her after news of the earthquake broke. But after her family posted a message on Facebook to say she was missing, M.S. Toll got back in touch with them via text to confirm she was okay. He told the BBC, I was trying not to panic. But when that text came through there was just elation. We heard conflicting stories about where the epicenter was so we didn't really know what to believe. He said initially she didn't know what was happening. She said the ground shook and then within 10 or 15 seconds it got worse and worse and then at that point she realized it was an earthquake. But it seemed to be over very, very quickly and fortunately she was okay. The building that they were in hadn't been damaged in any way. Mr. Toll said the main problem now was that due to the remoteness of the Pocker Lakes region where M.S. Toll is staying, she w.a.